problem is dy dx of sine of x, then sometimes we're kind of like quick to kind of jump to, oh, OK, well then y equals cosine of x plus c. Right? But then we say, oh, well, you know what? Mm, let me just go and check my answer here real quick. If this is the integral, or the antiderivative, sorry, if this is the antiderivative cosine of x, that means I can take the derivative of cosine of x and give me, my, give me uh, this derivative. So the derivative of cosine of x is negative sine of x. So obviously, I know that that is not the correct antiderivative. However, all I got to do is just nice, put a nice little negative there, because now, I know that the derivative of negative cosine of x will give me a positive sine of x, right? So just remember, guys, especially when you move fast, like some of you like to move fast with, you know, if you have time to go back and check some of your answers, you know, just go back and make sure that when you take the derivative working backwards, you're getting the same antiderivative, all right? All right, so I'm going to 